Hi, it's Josie and today I'd like to introduce you to Aiden. He's a four-year-old halflinger that has come to me for starting under saddle. And I'm about to show you an unedited version of his first ride out. You will miss the groundwork I do. I just start the video, uh, the video from when I'm riding him. I just want to tell you two things about him. One, uh, he spent uh, four weeks with another trainer a few months ago and then he spent a couple of, he was sent home for a couple of months and then he went back to the same trainer again for eight weeks to start under saddle. They had him for eight weeks but they didn't actually get on him. Uh, I'm not quite sure why. Uh, they told the owner to come pick him up and take him home. He was a little bit too reactive for them still. So she just uh, messaged me and asked me if I'd take a look at him for her, which I did and here he is. So I'm not quite sure what happened where he was. I wasn't there and I'm certainly not judging the person because the groundwork was actually awesome. But I find that a lot of these reactive, sensitive horses, you need to teach them to basically control their own emotions to, to help them work out how to do that. And um, if you have a horse like this that takes off on you, I know there's an old train of thought that if you're gonna move your feet, I'll make you move your feet. Uh, that to me, I don't do that. I don't do that with any horse to be honest, but I certainly wouldn't do, do it with a horse that was like this because you just make them super duper anxious, even more anxious. Anyway, Aiden came, I taught him how to control his own emotions and you'll see what sort of super horse he makes uh, as a trail riding horse, he's gonna be awesome. He did have a bit in, and that's the other thing I want to tell you, you will see that he's quite uncomfortable with the bit. He was when I started him, he's only had the bit in a few times, but it was quite uncomfortable for him. Some horses start like that and settle. Now, it was my fault because when horses come to me for starting under saddle, I make sure that the owner has had the teeth done before they come to me, like just before they come. They need to, they're young horses, their teeth are sharp. I assumed that he had his teeth done before he went to the other trainer, so it's my fault, I assumed. But he had, a, and in talking with the owner, it had been a year, so he definitely needed his teeth done. So until I can get a dentist to him, I'm just gonna work him in the halter and we may end up going on in a bitless bridle if I need to. But since I've put the halter on him, there's been no more mouth issues, so it's definitely a teeth issue, I think. Anyway, I hope you enjoy it. Yep. All right, so we have our lead horse here. He may have a spook or two, and if he does, that's fine, because horses are horses. But I'm gonna tell Michelle some rules so that she knows what they are. So basically, the big rule is that if I say stop or woo, you stop. Because it's not fair for you to keep walking and me making him stop. He has a, you can see that that's like a, in his brain, he wants to stay with the lead horse. You're making it very hard and very unfair. So as soon as you hear me say stop or woo, you must stop. Um, and I might be doing a one rein stop and you just got to sit there and relax until I get the horse to stop. Um, if my horse goes in front, that's if he's gonna walk past you, that's quite all right, long as your horse doesn't decide he wants to be the lead horse, which he might do. But yeah, sometimes they will just walk out and you just, just sit there and take it. We just walk for a while, I wanna see what he does. Um, I might walk over some poles and he's pretty chilled actually, so I'm pretty happy. So we'll just get on and see, and I'll because I'm here guys, just because I'm out here doesn't make any difference. He has to stand still when I get on. And if he doesn't, then I will put him in the, the circle like we normally do to ask him to stay still. Uh, all right, so I have him around here so that if he does go, and, he, and you know, I will be happy for anything I get out of this horse today. He, and that was already pretty good. That was just a shifting of his weight for um, the fact that I got on his back. Now I'm gonna, I haven't asked him to go anywhere, so he has to, this is what we've been doing on the arena. And I don't care that Wilbur's there. Um, he is not allowed to, can you, oh, it's all right, he's gonna move. He's not allowed to move, even if there's another horse to talk to until I give him a go forward aid. So sometimes this will be your whole lesson. I'm wondering what that is there, but it's my mic. All right, now I'm not gonna make him stand, I was about to ask him to go when he moved then. I won't make them, um, that's just the car behind him then he saw, I think. I'm not gonna make him stand still for too long because he's out somewhere, he needs to do something. So we're going this way, let's go Michelle. You just need to keep, woo. And when he trots like that, I'm gonna back him up once I've one rein stopped him and he has to be soft in front. 
Just come, come around this way. Good boy. Woo, and I'll just back him up. I thought he might be a little bit high energy. That's okay. And we're just going to walk in circles. Michelle, you can just walk a circle around us. I'll just let him have a little bit of a look at everything. Like you can just do a 20 meter circle around us. Aiden doesn't think he needs a lead horse. Good boy. No. Good boy. You're all right. We're going this way. If we go the opposite direction to you, it doesn't matter. Good boy. Woo. So back up. So this might be all we do today here is get him to walk here. But if, we, if that's all we do, that's a foundation lesson. That needs to stay. Good boy. I can see him looking at Wilbur now for a bit of direction. He goes, oh, is that it? And he goes, Wilbur, you walk too bloody slow. Good boy. Good boy. That's awesome. That's really good. That's just back him up a bit. He's smart. He works this out. Where's Wilbur? He's coming too. That wasn't a go forward aid, it was just me stretching my legs. We'll wait for Wilbur to catch up. Wilbur, you walk too slow. Good boy. So Aiden's dropping his head and neck, so that's awesome. Good boy. So the only thing that's changed today is where we are. Awesome. Yeah, now he's even trying to stretch, that's good. So we're gonna just walk over here, Michelle. You just keep following behind us because if we get stuck somewhere and he doesn't want to go, you just walk straight up and walk past us as if nothing was happening. And then he should like hook onto you. Good boy. Got to be happy with this though. Pardon? Uh, no, his right side is. Just going to back him up there because he did jig jog a little. He's gawking at everything and that's okay. He's allowed to look. Awesome, Michelle. We might just head around that way. So you just go that way and... Yeah, he's checking in with Wilbur. That's okay. You just sit there, relax. Make sure you've got all your relaxing seat on. You're not, you're not tight in the saddle at all. Because if he spooks, we're going to spook. Good. Good boy. Who said he's not going to make a trail riding horse? Look at this for his first trail ride. We'll go around the back of the arena. I'll, you stay on the roadside for me if you can. Oh, this horse is tight. It's being a perfect young horse. This is, I've had him a lot worse than this. Keep coming this way, you're getting left behind. Oh yeah, I've had them a lot worse than this, God. Oh, is he nervous? Come on, Aiden will be the lead horse. Aiden wants to go and have a look at these things. They're a bit scary, he says, but I want to check them out. Part of my work, if you remember in the early days with him, was encouraging him to be curious. So that like he's looking at this stuff and he wants to go up there. I'm not making him, but if he does, I'm not going to stop him. Um, and I just sitting here relaxed, there's a car coming behind us. I can, I hear things when I'm on a horse. Cause, cause, you're all right. You're all right. You just walk quietly. Are you okay? It's okay, go grab him, otherwise I'll be in a pickle. Don't run at him when you get there, slow down. <laughs> now you have to get on him. What happened? Maybe um, to remember to try keep your nose behind you, right behind your belly button. Yeah, I think just because he's... Uh, I don't know. Well, I was in the air and I thought, I'm just jumping 
Oh, you bailed out. Oh, no, I was standing on my left Ah. You all right? Didn't hurt yourself? I got it on video, though. <laughs> I'm not cutting it out, either. <laughs> Everyone's come off a horse. Oh boy. But the best thing was this boy did nothing. And Wilbur took off. And this boy did nothing. You should go with him if you relax so low. Keep your nose behind the belly button. But Aiden, um, Aiden did nothing, so that's awesome. And as long as you didn't actually hurt yourself. You didn't hurt yourself? No, no. no I only did a bit on the ankle. Ah, oh, yep. Yeah, good girl. Bend him, bend him. Come on, you're supposed to be the lead horse, mate. That's okay, you come over this side, we'll do the road. So as soon as you feel him gonna do something, sit back and bend him. Like that. So yeah, just bend him. Perhaps you need to teach him what I've taught Aiden. He's going to trot, and I'm going to stop and back him up. You got to stop when I back up. Sorry. When I when I back him up, you can't be walking away from him because that's unfair on him. You're being naughty. It's all right. Well, I should say wool, so then you know to stop. Sorry. Good. Well, I'm going to go walk over some poles now. All right. Don't worry about it. Is that the first time you come off him? Yeah. Oh, good. As in, there's first time for everything, so it's done now. Yeah. Good. That's crazy. I think it's just I didn't even think about it. Wait. Boy, are you going to do a poo yourself or are you just sniffing that one? Good boy. Yeah, good boy. Yeah, his whole body's relaxing now. That is good. We'll go over here. So Wilbur won't be very good going through the cross-country course then. Will he spook? At the moment, but yep. in 10 minutes he, he might just be dead in 10 minutes and then he'll be fine. Look at your horse go. As soon as Wilbur chills, he's chilled. Look at your horse go. This one here, look at him. What a star. Good. That's awesome. We're just gonna go out and walk around behind this because yep. it's something to gawk at. No, God no. Well, I don't think he'll kick. So he's already thinking, oh, I can't go past that, see, there. So I'm just going, it's okay, mate, and this is when you come into play, when you're not allowed to spook, Wilbur, because he'll get his confidence from Wilbur. Yeah. And if you think Wilbur's going to spook, just tell me and go the other way so that we don't set up a situation that I can't control. Good boy, Aiden. Well, Aiden's being very good because he keeps gawking at that and then jumping, and then he's going to trot here, woo. Will you back? Doesn't matter. No, softly, mate. Good. Walk on. Good boy. Don't walk up his bum. Yeah, good. That's a good boy. So this is good. There's lots of things for him to look at. He has hardly been looky at all. Uh, Rebel was worse than him when I came out to do my dressage test. I'm being honest. <laughs> All right, do you think Wilbur will walk past those things on the, in the middle there, this side? Uh, without? Because I'd like to take Aiden through there. Good. Aiden is being very good, Michelle. Like, I'm stoked with him. Yeah, he's behaving better than Wilbur. <laughs> good boy. Good boy. Boy.
Good. Very brave. There's a there's a bridge there I'd like you to walk over. Did you? It's pretty narrow. Should be a bit wider. Good boy. You just keep walking if he stops and gawks at something. You just walk past us. As if nothing's there, because that's how he gets his confidence. Good. We might even walk up to that bridge. What do you reckon, Aiden? We just get on the inside of Wilbur so we don't push Wilbur into it. Oh my golly gosh. Look at this. Boy, <laughs> he wants the grass. You let him have the grass. No, you're not. I don't trust you at the moment. Off you go. Good. Stay, you just stay there, Michelle. Stay there and let him eat for a minute. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. You're all right. You're brave. Yeah. Yeah, you're brave. Come on. Off we go. This way. Good boy. Mm -hmm. What about this one? You want to eat some grass? Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Whoop. 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 You're right there eating grass for a minute. Yes, you're a good boy. I haven't got anything for you. You haven't finished yet. I know you think you have. Come on. Oh, very clever. Let's move that out a bit, mate. How heavy is it? Probably very heavy. Oh, yeah, it's a bit too heavy for me to move. Let's do this again. Come on. Very clever boy. He's a very clever boy. This way, up here. Up, oh, up on it. That's the way. That's okay. Good boy. Hey, you clever? Are you clever? Again, even though I'm getting on him here, he has to stand still and wait. Good. That was good. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. You can be brave. Good boy. Yes, you can be brave. I promise you can. Yep, this way. Oh. Boy, clever boy, clever boy. Let's do it the other way if we can. Come on, this way, turn left. Oh. That was only because when he bent forward and he pitched to me, I grabbed with my legs to keep myself on. That's all he humped for. He's got sensitive sides. Here we go, no, 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 no. Let go of that range, Ace. Let's move. Yeah, good. Come on, you can do this. I know you can. I've got lots of faith in you, mate. Uh, more faith in you than I got in Rebel. <laughs> no, not really. Welcome. Good boy. Nope. Up we go. Ah, good. Very good. Very good. That's the way, my boy. Let's go. Up we go. Up, this way. You can go over it. Come on. Good. Good boy. Good 
boy. Let's try again. Yeah, you can trot because I did bump you there. Walking. Good. Come this way. Walking. Yeah, just walking, mate. And we'll do a trot in a minute. Nope. Whoop. Yeah, remember the aids? No. No. Left. Off my left leg. That's the boy. Good. No. Yeah, no, I know. You got this. You got this. You got nowhere to go but forward. Come on. No, no. Good boy. Yes. Yes, good boy. Up you go. Should have got your camera out then. Should have got your camera out. Get it out. Get it out. We'll do another one. I just want to give him something for that. As long as you've got carrot at the other end. You tell me when you're ready. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Up, oh, whoop, 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 whoop. Keep videoing though. Well, you can cut it down. That, that was the rider error for not getting him. Good boy, straight at the other end. Good boy. Uh, 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 uh. Good boy. All right, stop and start it again. Let me line him up properly. Good whoop, whoop. That's a boy. No, that's a boy. Okay, let's go. You got this. You got this. You got this. Nope. You got this. This way. That's it. Yes, good. Walk on. Walk on. Walk on. Not half on, half off. We have to start again. Sorry, mate. You're a good boy. Get your hind quarter under, that's the boy. And walk. And walk. No. This way. Yes, good. And straight. And no, don't run through the bridle. Good boy. Yeah, you're okay. You're okay. No, no, you're all right. Actually, we'll just go cross sideways first again. I want to give him something I can praise him for. Up. Good. Very good boy. Clever. Clever. All right, we're going to do this once now. You're going straight over this and then we're going to not come back to that at all. I want to check that out. Walk on. Walk on. Walk on. Good boy. Nope. Yep. Once more. Once more. You can do it. You can do it. I got faith in you, mate. Up we get. Up we get. That's it. <laughs> that wasn't good enough, though. Straight over it. Where are you going? No, no. Move your bum. That's the way. Well, those cups are rather dangerous hanging off the side there. All right. Up over it. That's the way. Nope. Whoop, 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 whoop. Straight. That's the way. Yay! Good boy. Good boy. Now we're not doing that anymore today. I got a sugar cube for you. Yes. Yes. Good boy. Okay. We do a little bit of trotting and then I'm actually going to call that a day, Michelle. He's been a good boy. I'm going to trot away from you. Are you right if I do that? Okay. Steady, steady, that's a boy, that's a boy, that's a nice trot, that's a nice trot, good, steady, Ooh. this way, good boy, good boy Aiden.
No, no. It's all right. That's a boy. You're okay. You're okay. You're okay. No, you can't. Yeah, don't walk away from us. Just stay in the general area. Good boy. Turn. That's a boy. Turn, you got to turn, mate. I don't be doing any head shaking. That's a boy. Trot poles already. coming up the inside of you over the trot poles to the left of you sorry Clever boy, aren't you? Clever boy. Not galloping, just cantering, buddy. Good boy. Good boy. Do a little bit the other way. I know. Hang on, let's just walk first. We're nearly done, mate. You're nearly done. Canter right first. Oh, and that's a good walk too, my man. Drop, yep, good. This way. Yes. There'll be none of that. Ooh. Yeah, all right. No, turn the corner. That's the boy. That's better. Now, how about we do another transition without a pig root in it, all right? Yep, yep, yeah, no pig rooting. Good boy. Steady. Steady. Woohoo. Good. Let's walk. Let's walk. Nope, we've got to walk now. Now you're all stirred up, you can walk. Not finished yet. He's pretty good, you know. Well, like he took off a bit there, but he comes back to me. He was getting faster and faster, but he came back. You know, I just bent him and he came back. And the best bit is, he's walking. Like he's not a oh, like the thoroughbreds get when you give them a bit of a canter. Touch his bum. No, good boy. Yeah. Are you ready to be done? I'm pretty happy with you. I'm very happy with this walk at the end. And you can go and stand next to Wiki Uber. Ooh. Yes, you're a good boy. Ooh, good boy. And that's done. Good. Stoked. <laughs>